You know, folks, I spent a lot of time over there artfully carving, planning, and polishing the spruce and willow wood of today's news, stringing it with the alloy-treated synthetic cat gut of the latest headlines to craft the Stradivarius that is my monologue. But after the applause dies down, I like to collect my roses and take that fiddle down to Meemaw's cellar, bang on an overturned basin, scrape the old washboard, finish off the bathtub moonshine of the day's smaller story so I can holler them back at you in the barefoot jug band hoedown of a segment that I call... <laughs> Meanwhile. <laughs> it gives and it gives. And it's a bottomless well of joy. Meanwhile. Meanwhile. A Florida traffic stop led to two narcotics arrests after police found a bag containing drugs in the car. The tip-off? The bag was labeled bag full of drugs. <laughs> and they would have gotten away with it if not for their getaway vehicle. <laughs> Meanwhile, YouTube has revealed its ad revenues for the first time, and it's a whopping $15 billion a year. Now, you may ask how YouTube is raking in such an insane amount of money, but the <laughs> fact... No, no, not the YouTube ad countdown thing! No! We don't want... Head stuck in a drawer? You need drawer freshener! The only non-FDA approved... Yes, skip ad! <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Love that. Why do they... Why do they always show me that one ad? I googled head stuck in a drawer one time. <laughs> Meanwhile, a team of scientists believe yarn grown from human skin could soon be used to stitch up surgical patients and repair organs. The head of the team was quoted as saying, and it's definitely not for making human centipedes, if that's what you're thinking. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm just gonna take a bunch of the skin back to my basement home lab. You know what's not worth worrying about? Missing hitchhikers. <laughs> the... <laughs> the researchers say their human textile, which they developed from skin cells, can be used for knitting, sewing, and even crochet, and can aid a number of medical procedures. Wait, Anne <laughs> can aid in medical procedures? That makes it sound like the primary purpose is regular knitting and crocheting. <laughs> oh, I'm just making another skin scarf for Joey. <laughs> I worry that off in college he's not staying creepy enough. <laughs> Gotta remember to refrigerate that. <laughs> Meanwhile, Robert Pattinson is the hottest man in the world, according to math. <laughs> the calculations were performed by the renowned research team of Becca and Haley. <laughs> Pattinson's number one hottie status actually comes from plastic surgeon Julian De Silva, who made his determination using something called the Golden Ratio of Beauty Phi, an ancient formula that is widely used to measure physical perfection. Great job, Dr. De Silva. Historically, if you're calculating physical perfection using a formula, you're one of the good guys. <laughs> As De Silva points out, Leonardo da Vinci used Beauty Phi when drawing the Vitruvian Man. Yes, famous smoke show, the Vitruvian Man. I mean, just look at how hot he is. Mm. I mean, you could just, yeah. Mm. You could just lose yourself in that cavernous eye socket. <laughs> Meanwhile, Red Lobster has released heart-shaped boxes of Cheddar Bay biscuits for Valentine's Day. I love when food comes in a package that's the shape of the thing it's gonna destroy. <laughs> that's why... I love them. That's why I exclusively drink Dr. Cirrhosis liver-shaped bourbon. Meanwhile, Domino's Pizza has debuted a one-of-a-kind pizza-themed engagement ring. Perfect for people who want to guarantee the end of their relationship in 30 minutes or less. <laughs> we'll be right back with James Taylor.